hair and fair skin. Pat Penner knew he faced a better than fair risk for skin cancer. And one day I found something that um, didn't look right and I thought that it made sense to go get it checked out. A multicolored mole with an irregular texture and shape concerned him enough to visit the doctor. It was on my right calf and it had all the things they say you need to look for. A biopsy revealed the worst. It was not only cancer, but melanoma, the most dangerous form of skin cancer. Despite all of the things that I saw and all the warnings, I still believe that he would tell me it was nothing. It's not what he wanted to hear, but oncologist Frank Rodriguez says it may have been his lucky day. If melanoma gets picked up early, usually a surgery is all you need. However, as the melanoma grows, then the chances that it will infiltrate surrounding tissues or even spread to the lymph nodes or even beyond the lymph nodes to other organs goes up. Pat underwent a radical resection, which meant going back to the site where the mole was and taking out a wider margin of tissue. To make sure that there's nothing left behind. Now, depending on how deep it is, you may be done at that point, but most people would recommend um, getting what's called a sentinel lymph node, which is the lymph node or the part of the immune system that most likely drains the cells that came from that part of the skin. Pat had the sentinel node removed and checked for cancer. The result was negative. In the 10 years since, there's been no recurrence. He considers his doctors lifesavers. You know, I was fortunate to be able to have them diagnose this at an early stage and um, to take care of it. And now it's, it's not an issue. And so melanoma is a bad disease um, and it's one that you can really modify the outcomes if you just find it early. Recognizing it quickly and treating it properly can prevent a mole from becoming a mountain. For Lee Memorial Health System, I'm Amy Osher.